Hello dear students, I hope that everyone is doing well. Welcome to today's lesson that is about the reported speech. We have talked before about the reported speech and we said that the reported speech is the process of reporting someone's words or someone's saying. When I report someone else's words, I have many rules to follow. So together, we're going to see why do we use the reported speech. We use it to report what another person has said. But not using the speaker's exact words, we have to change sometimes the pronouns and sometimes the tenses. And of course, before I report someone's words, I have to start my sentence with reporting verbs like tell, say, um, speak, ask, warn and other things. You know, the first rule in the reported speech is that we have to look at the reporting verb. If the reporting verb is in the simple present, like he says that, there is no change. So nothing changes from direct to indirect speech except for the pronouns and the adverbs. For example, I, it will be he or she. Um, our, it will be there or uh, here it will be there as well. But the change happens when the reporting verb is in the simple past, which means when I say he said that or he told me that. So, for example, we have in the, uh, in the um, um, examples, uh, we were here yesterday. He said that they had been there the day before. So simple past changed into past perfect. More examples. When I have in the direct speech, I'm going home. When I report this, I'm going to change the present continuous into the simple continuous. Um, she said that she was going home. So, as we said, when the reporting verb is in the simple past, we change the tenses from present to past, from past to past perfect, from present continuous to past continuous. And here we have another or more examples about reporting the requests. For example, when someone says, can you turn off the, your cell phone? You report it as the following. She, the teacher asked me to do this, to turn off my cell phone um, and uh, my mom asked me to come to visit her very soon. So that's all for this lesson and thank you so much.